Hey guys! Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. <laughs> it's wet. It's a wet, rainy adventure day. It's what, what we get for deciding <laughs> to go to a theme park up north. <laughs> We're here in Rotherham. We're doing Gulliver's Valley. Mm -hmm. This is going to be the first of a little mini series of Gulliver's Parks that we yeah. decided to do on the channel. We booked them all. Yeah, we have. <laughs> We've booked every <laughs> single one of them. Why not? Someone's like, you ever been to Gulliver's? We'll do, we'll do them all. Um, yeah, so we don't know how much we're going to get done today because it is very, very wet. We've been sat in the car for the last 40 minutes hoping it's going to get better. <laughs> it uh, did start, but it's starting again it's now. It's starting again now. <laughs> so we'll see what we're getting. We're going to take you inside, show you what it's all about. We're excited because we've never been here before. No, first time. Yeah, it's well, new, I believe. It's not that old, this park. Is it not? And there's a brand new area in this park that only opened this year. Well, there you go then. There you go. All the information coming from Ange today. Uh, we're about to go into the Castle Barn. So we're heading in there now and uh, we'll take you inside with us. Oh, I could get used to this. So we've come through the entrance now, so it's all the indoor area. It's cool where the shop was and stuff like that, wasn't it? Yeah, it's fun themed. And then we're headed outside into the rain. And we're going to the first part area, which is like a build area with JCBs. Only just seen it straight away and was like there. That is where we're gonna go. So that's where we're heading now. So we're now at the big diggers and Ollie's got it here ready to set it off into the big ball pit. If you start pressing the start button, see that's the button there. Yeah, the one that's a start. Yeah, that yeah. Big, a big green button there is the start. Oh, so I'm not filming it, there you go. There, Not there. A green button there. Just to give you an idea, so that's the entrance over there. And as you first come into the right hand side, this is kind of like the digger area that we've just been into, the small and the big ones. And then you have a hot air balloon ride. A ride very similar to what you get at Drayton Manor, where you've got to put the, uh, the fire out. And then dumbbells. Yeah. Yeah, let's Flying go. elephants. And then as we move over here, this is where you get to the toy land where all the soldiers are and stuff like that. After much searching, I found the vault. We finally found the vault everyone's talking about. It's inside the bank. You going inside it? What? You going inside the vault? I'm going, in, I'm going through here. Then. Okay, go on. Good luck. I'm going oh, I you could close it. Oh. Go. This is a cool little area inside the uh, western. So there's the bank. Next door is a little shop. But like, there's a walkway at the top that the kids can go through. He's in prison now. Oh, and he works his way to prison. I mean, that's a that's a swift, but like, uh, I mean, he must got caught because he went yeah. in the vault. Oh, look, there he is. Did you do bad? Yeah. You're in prison. No, it's not. It's just a walking area. <laughs> it's just a walking area, my way. <laughs> just a walking area. And now, is it blacksmiths? So, I tell you what, that whole like, system seems to work. He robs a bank, goes to prison, ends up being trained as a blacksmith. Yeah. So we are currently in Western World. Ollie, you've just been on the climbing frame. It looks like a train. Was that fun? Oh, I didn't notice it was a train. Did you not? Oh, that's cool. Oh, man, let me show everyone. Oh, that is cool. There you go. That's the train. Yeah. Um, this little area is actually pretty cool. So like, it's, it's a West, really well like, Western themed. There's like, at the moment, how many rides is there? Um, We're going to the train, Daddy. Five, the play area, and then the little Daddy. indoor play area with the little Daddy. bank heist. Mm. Oh, it's called a bank heist. Oh, it's called? Yeah. So we're going to head on to the mine train now. Let's we'll show you that. That looks like that. Yeah. Is that the mine train? That's not the mine train, that's just a train. Yes, yeah, so we're going to head on the mine train now and show you other bits and pieces in this land. So we'll do this area and then we'll move on to another one straight after that. That sounds like a good idea. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan? Yeah. Yeah, come on then, let's I'm do it. Come on. 
So the first ride, Rocky Ridge Railway, that's easy to say, Rocky, Rocky Ridge, Ridge Railway, Railway uh, has been completed. <laughs> Ollie, that good? what do you reckon? It's <laughs> good, wasn't it? It's going. I want to go faster now. He's like, yeah, I think he's used to a little bit more of a thrill ride compared to that. Did you want to go faster? Yeah, pull up there. All right, you can pull me out. All right, Tombstone, Tombstone Mine. Mine. Is that what you want to do? Yeah. I want to do that. Tombstone Mine. Yeah. Is that the next train going on? Yeah, yep. I think so. Uh, it's got a queue. It's got a little queue. A little queue. It won't take long. The queues yep. here are nowhere near compared to what we have in no. other parks. There's like two people in front of but us. But it's on a that much one. smaller park. So it's very small. Yeah. So we're and, heading on. And it was a rainy day, so I think that's got in our favour. Definitely. So we're heading on now. Tombstone Mine. Let's go. <laughs> So we're finished on the Tombstone Mine train. I blinked. You blinked. <laughs> yeah. I said it on the video, it's the fastest ride in the wilderness. <laughs> blinked and I missed it. Ollie, what did you reckon of the mine train? As you can tell, really, really bothered by that. No, uh, do you know what? It was good. It was like all glow in the dark. But to be honest, I will confess, I was trying to film you going through. Realised this camera was having none of it and tried to switch cameras and by the time I switched to my phone, it was done. It was, done. <laughs> <laughs> it was yeah. a cute little ride though. Cool. They're absolutely brilliant for little kids. Yeah. Brilliant for little kids. Ollie's absolutely loving it, isn't he? Yeah. He wants to go on them all again. So it's like, oh, the thing is, there's, no, there's hardly any cues, which is great for a little kid. Yeah? You don't want to go, no, he doesn't, he doesn't want, he's saying he doesn't want to go on this. He doesn't, he doesn't want to go. That's fine. Right, we're heading that way. Let's go. See, he's just he's impatient now. He's like, let's go to the next, <laughs> he's next ride. Next ride, next ride. But yeah, as I said, it's great for little little kids. Yeah. So as I said, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Right. Okay. So as I said, it is great for little kids. Little cues, little rides. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we're heading on, and we're going to continue in this little area. What's the area called? Western. World. Western World. I think, I think if we're wrong, it'll be up there somewhere. Yeah, exactly. So we're heading now. We'll show you what else we've got. Bye, right, Ollie. We're at Sioux City Express and Prairie Ponies? We've on the train. Prairie Ponies. Prairie Ponies, thank you. Ollie, which one are we doing? Train or ponies? Ponies. Which one? Train. Train. Okay, train. Ponies now, there he is. Look at him. Doesn't need mummy and daddy for this one. On his own horse. Look how happy he is wiggling. There he goes. Was that yeah. a good ride? Yeah. What was the score? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up or thumbs down? The ride, is it thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Yeah. Thumbs up. Yes, the only seal of approval. The other big kind of ride in this area, so you've got Desperado Drop, which Ollie doesn't want to do, and then Apache Falls, which is like, um, what am I looking for? What ride am I looking for? Viking River Splash. <laughs> River 
River Rapids. River Rapids, as you can <laughs> tell, the riveting theme park vloggers. Doesn't even know what a. I can't believe I just did that. Anyway, moving on. He's gone back up here now. This is the second train of the two that's in the area. Pretty much identical to the last one. So we've just watched people come off the uh, River Rapids. A little bit wet? Soaking wet. Soaking wet. He says, doesn't look anything. There was a little waterfall on the back that gets you all wet. I just heard him say. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Um, this yeah, we're, we're skipping that for now. Yeah, it was a fast skip. slide. Yeah. He's come back from the, uh, from the playground. So another thing we've noticed in the Western world is there's plenty of indoor picnic areas. So plenty of shelter if you are bringing your own food. So there's like one here at the side and then there's another one here behind me. So plenty of places to be able to go and like have a picnic if you want to bring your own food with you. He's pointing at that. He's like, whoa. Um, it looks intense, that. Uh, yeah, I have to admit, for a little kid, like, just watch how fast this goes down. Ready? Pretty intense. <laughs> Guys wouldn't do it. No, nah, I wouldn't do that. I, w I would do that. I I've done crop flop. <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> off, we're, off of this, we're going to gears. Off to gears. So we've arrived in gears now. It started to rain, hence the umbrella. Where's Anne? She's around here somewhere. There she is. It's way too warm for a cold up. I know, this is the problem, isn't it? It's yeah. like it's raining, but it's way too warm. Um, so as you've come into the main area, you've got like four buildings that have got like vintage cars in it. And then over to the side, you've got Dodge City, which is Dodgems. Then you've got Car Fari, which is just basically a car safari. And then the big ride, which is the Grand Prix races. Oli has decided he doesn't want to do Grand Prix races, which is fine. We'll probably come back down to it later and see if he wants to have a go later. Yep. So as I mentioned before, Gears is the newest part of here at Gulliver's Valley. Yes. Um, and we've noticed that also it's got the biggest queues. So, I mean, I'm guessing... I mean, when we say big queues, they're not there's massive. no such thing as a big no, queue. No, you're probably talking, what, 20 minutes maximum for that car fari. Yeah. Um, but we're not doing it. We're going to wait until hopefully it'll die down a bit later on. Yeah, uh, Grand I Prix, think it will. which is up here, has got a bit of a queue, but we're not too sure how long that's going to be. No. Um, and then you've got the dodgems again. So that is something to just bear in mind that they don't post wait times anywhere. No. I'm guessing because they don't get long enough to really... Yeah. Yeah. This Waste one's five minutes, here. this one's two minutes, this one's five minutes. Yeah, I don't think they're long enough to warrant posting a, a no. time. So we're finished with gears for now, we're going to come back a little bit later on. But I know that everyone's been waiting for this, because like, this is something that everyone needs in their life. So let me just walk you over to it. You ready? Just, just compose yourself. Now you're ready. Sheep fact. Everyone loves a sheep fact. Did you know that male sheep are called rams? Yep. Did you know that female sheep are called ewes? Yep. Babies are called lambs? Yep. There are over one billion sheep in the world, with China having the largest number. However, Britain have the largest number of native breeds. So I didn't know that fact. So I also didn't realise that breeds is spelt wrong. They put breads. <laughs> it, has the, it has the largest number of native breeds. That's this week's edition of Sheep Facts. <laughs> Tune in next week. There's not going to be a next week. Well, there might be. We're going to another all of us. So. Maybe. <laughs> the suspense must be killing you. <laughs> and there's a peacock. Where's a peacock? There's a peacock. I'm thinking you'll find that's a duck. And it's not just any duck. Theme park. Duck. Swimming in the pond. A theme park duck. Anyway, forget this segment and we'll move on with the rest of the video, shall we? <laughs> We're now into the Lost World, which is the dinosaur area. And would you like to know your dinosaur name? Apto... A What? A pato. A pato Ollie's... Oh, my feet, it means a feet. ...is oviraptor. And mine is gigantoraptor. Giganta. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that. Oh dear. Guy Gangster. We're at the Lost World. We're heading on to the dinosaur rodeo now. So. Oh, I feel like a fool.
Yorkie the T-Rex. Do you that's because we're in Yorkshire? No, it's because it's not for girls. Ah! He's there! He's there! He's found us! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Are those his babies? Her babies? Da 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 thriller, thriller, no. So we're now in the Lost World area, so you've got this one which is the gyrosaur, which goes upside down. So it's a little. too small for that. Yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit, in, a bit intense for him, that, isn't it? Well, he's, he's too short. I think it's 120. Oh, okay. That one. That's the only one in the whole entire park that he's not tall enough for. Okay. So there's 27 rides here. But I think they're including, like, the diggers and stuff as rides. Yeah. Um, but yeah, 27 of them and there's one that he can't go on, so there's a lot to do. And then up here, that's the T-Rex Tower. So it's like a water slide to go down there, but Ollie's not interested in doing that today. Not today. I think that's because he went on the one at Portland's Park, which was a little bit bigger than that. And it shocked yeah. him. <laughs> Guys, I'll leave the link to that video. Yes. Actually, I'll put a little clip in now, showing him shots. This is one we're on now, which is the Lost World, which is like a little boat ride. So this is the one we're heading into now. You've got the paraglider over here. So there's quite a lot in this little area, isn't there? Yeah, there's, there's, it's a decent area. And it's all really well themed and clean. Yeah. We're just waiting for the ride now. We're going to get wet. I'm not happy. I'm not happy right <laughs> now. We saw a guy then get completely drenched on the first drop into the water. So this is going to be fun. I don't want to do it now. <laughs> it's all down my back. <laughs> oh so, my God. Just to show you. It's all over your pants. I'm so like, so it's, it, it's they got like a little puddle. How wet did so I get? I can't see oh it from God, here. Oh God, it's so wet. I can't see it from here. We're not moving. We're going. It's like green bath water. Look at it. <laughs> it's literally like. I don't know what bath you're like getting in. Like a bubble bath. Oh no! I was like, what bath are you getting in? <laughs> I got my arm stuck. So the camera battery just died, didn't it? Yeah. So we're now on a phone. Look how happy these dinosaurs are. Look how happy. Ollie, is this a good ride? Yeah. He's can got his hood up because he thinks he's getting wet. Can we just appreciate, though, the, the leg manoeuvrage? I know, here? like, I've got my legs up this side. Ollie's got his legs up and gas. Straight down the middle. Because nobody wants wet feet. It's literally an Arlo. I know, it is. It's the good dinosaur. Disney, you might need to put in a request to have the dinosaur taken away. <laughs> He looks happy. <laughs> he looks well out. He's like, I've got a stick. <laughs> oh, there's a band. What type of uh, music do you reckon they play? Oh, go on. I don't know. You got old rock. He's trying to think of like something dinosaur witty joke wise, yeah. and he can't think of anything. Dinosaur rock. Dinosaur rock. Dinosaur rock. Why have we just stopped? That's what I'm saying. We're not like moving properly. I swear we're going to get stuck because we sat with our feet up. Right, if some, by the way, if somebody can think of the ending of that job that's so actually... Yeah, drop it in the comments in for the us. Comments <laughs> what, what type of music do the dinosaurs play? Because we're clearly not witty or funny enough to think of an answer. Rock and roll? Rock and roll? I mean, that's pretty funny. Rock and roll. Rock Could be the dinosaurs of the Stone Age. Maybe the band. Queens of the Stone Age. <laughs> like I said, guys, if anyone can find anything funny, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it in the comments below. This guy's laughing. Look, he's going. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> how good was that water ride? Did we get wet? Did get, how wet? What did we see on the ride? Dinosaurs. Happy dinosaurs. <laughs> Extremely happy dinosaurs. Yeah, and a band. Yeah. Playing <laughs> rock and roll. <laughs> what are we doing now? You're going to get your balloon. So there's an event on here which is all to do with dinosaurs today, and they're giving out dinosaur balloons as part. By giving out, they're selling. Well, yeah, selling. two quid, two quid for the balloons. So we're going to head over there now, and then that's pretty much us, it, us done for the dino area. Yeah, dino area is there's, complete then. There's a lot we're not more. going on gyrosaur. No. Because that's obviously too big for us. Yeah. And it doesn't want to do the boats, so that's this area done. So we are now leaving the Lost World, but we couldn't leave without taking this little guy with us. Say hello, mate. Hello. Yes, no idea what he's called, but there we go. At 42 quid. You were wrong. Seven pounds. You are kidding me. <laughs> I just didn't know that until right at that point. That's a genuine reaction there, ladies and gentlemen. 
Seven pounds that blue. <laughs> wow. <laughs> But anyway, he wanted it, so we decided to go and get it. Well, yeah, we thought it was two pounds and we'd already picked it. Yes, so we did. Clearly. But, I mean, I don't know if it's seven pounds because the last one of the day, it's not. No, it's, it was just seven pounds. If that floats away now, I'm going to be not happy. <laughs> if that, tighten in the, let's just quickly tighten that string to make sure it doesn't fly away. Don't worry, I'm tightening it. Seven pounds. I swear that guy told us two pounds before. I think it was probably like from, and it was probably like the little things. You, anyway, uh, pirates? Yeah, let's go. Pirates. So Ollie's currently playing in the pirate ship play area. Yeah, he's decided he's not feeling the barrels of the pirate ship. They're a bit big for him and a bit fast. Yeah, there's, there's a few things that are in this area. It's like you've got the big kind of swinging pirate ship, the barrels that are like teacups. Yeah, the drunken barrels. And then you've got like a little boat. I was gonna say boat race, but it's not, is it? It's like a, it's like pedalos. Oh yeah, that's not open yet. That's open for there's like two times. Two times throughout, throughout the, day. the day. So we're just waiting for that to open. I'll, I think it opens in like five minutes. Yeah, I took a picture of when that is, so I'll just insert that in that bit there at the top. Um, so yeah, so we're having kind of going around this little bit of area, but overall, everywhere is very well themed. So well themed, and the play areas are like on point. Yeah. For the like each play area in the themed land is so themed. Yeah. Like this one's a giant um, pirate, pirate ship. ship. Uh, why is my balloon tied up? To make sure it doesn't go anywhere. Because it costs seven pounds, Ollie, and I don't well, want we don't, to go to lose it. We don't, want to, we don't want to lose it. Ollie, go and fire the cannons. Go fire the cannons. Oh, here comes the balloon. There we are. Um, overall though, I haven't found this place too bad. Uh, there's a few things that are a bit strange, like they don't have any pram parking even though it's a kids park. The queues aren't too bad. No, there's not been any really long queue. I think the longest queue was the car far. The longest Luke. queue was the car far. <laughs> yeah, which, which we decided not to do. But there's plenty of like rides for you to go around to kind of miss around doing things. So overall, if, terms of, if you've got little ones, I think it's a pretty decent day out. Yeah. It is. Ollie's absolutely loving it, especially the play areas. Like, he's just he would be happy to have come here and just go from play area to play area yeah, today. Yeah, there's tons of play areas. And that's part of the reason he doesn't want to go on. We hope that you're enjoying this vlog, but we had to interrupt it because we know how much everyone loves sheep facts, right? Angie's now stuck. So we thought, we won't just bring you sheep facts. Oh no. Duck bum facts. bum bum. Duck facts. Ducks are known as waterfowl because they are found in water. True fact. True fact. Actual true fact. I know. True fact. Ducks can be found in every continent except the Antarctica. The Antarctica or just Antarctica? Antarctica. <laughs> just that. Ducks are omnivores, which means that they eat both plants and animals. Stay away, Ollie. I'll have you. It is said that a duck's quack will not echo. This is untrue. Yeah. Quack. I never heard that they didn't echo before. I heard that as well. And duck's feathers are highly waterproof. Demonstrating it right there. By shaking the water off his tail feathers. Back to this regular programming. Duck's facts oh, is oh, oh. over. So as we said before, we're heading into Gears again. So it's a little bit later on in the, in the day now. So we're going to head in there and see if the queued areas and the rides that were there earlier on are a little bit quieter we're expecting to. It should be. Yeah. If it's good. like normal theme park. Yeah. So we're heading in there now. Yeah. Oh, we made it round to Carfari. And as we suspected, there was no queue. Uh, oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to gauge your genuine reaction to the ride? It's so it's thrilling. Hot. But you know what? Doesn't matter what you think of it. Look at what he thinks of it. Ready to get us round this corner, pal. Ready? Ready, ready. Turn, 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 turn. Turn. We would have gone straight into the hedge. It's turned all the way already, look. Oh, yeah. Straight enough, Ollie. So, not thrilling for the adults, but kids love it. So. Carfari. And that's Carfari, Ollie. What were you reckoning, bud? Cool. <laughs> cool. Can't wait until he's a teenager. Anyway, um, 
It was all right though, wasn't it? It was a cute kid's ride. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, I expected more like animals. Yeah, I mean, there was, got, two there was a car. There wasn't much fiery, was there? <laughs> yeah. There was like what two sheep, yeah. two baby lambs. That's about yeah. it. Let's go. Do you know what he wants to go on next? What? He wants to go on the bumper cars. Oh, okay, dodgings. I mean, how much have we looked out here as well? Look at this. I know. Yeah, it's we're going now. I can't believe it. That's crazy. Um, as well, I think the reason for the big queue there compared to other rides is like there's five um, cars, and um, but they have to have them all arrive in the station to let them off. It's not like a rolling going, is it? You're no. All in, all out, and that takes a while to kind of unload and stuff like that. So that's the reason for the longer queue. So the Grand Prix racer is probably the main attraction here at Gulliver's Valley. And it's now 10 past four, it closes at five, and there's no queue. So if you do arrive and there is a massive queue during the day, our advice would definitely be to wait nearer the end because there isn't any queue and you can go on it multiple times. And we seem to find that at most theme parks that towards the end of the day, a lot of people that have been there since park open have left and the queues really, really decreased. Especially on a weekday because like school trips and stuff like that, they all, they leave, all leave early. early. But this is a weekend, this is a Saturday. And again, the same has happened here. Yeah, and we found this at Legoland as well, that on a Saturday, yeah. towards the end of the day. After like two o'clock, isn't it? After two, yeah. that's when it starts to die down. That's what we've noticed anyway. Yeah. Theme park balloons are good, but all they end up doing is smacking you in the face all day. <laughs> you alright there, Ange? <laughs> It must have hit me a hundred times. It just really likes you. I don't really like it. So we're now back near the entrance of the park and we've come across Monster Mansion. But cool. We have no idea what it is. It says it's a walkthrough that may be frightening to very young children. Hold my hand. Take me, let's go. It's a maze. It's a maze. It's amazing. Look, it's not the eyeball ones. Oh wow, look at all these. Oh, look at that! Hey, Groot. Hey, Groot. <laughs> How cute is he? So cute. Inspiration um, uh, from Monsters Inc. Maybe. They're eating the eyeballs for tea. They're eating the eyeballs for tea, are yeah, they? Yeah, for rolls. <laughs> is it? Is it? Is it? Oh my, come on. <laughs> I mean, that's definitely I think. <laughs> that's so it. And the scariest part of the journey. The exit. The exit. <laughs> it was like a monster zinc walkthrough. What do we think of the mansion? Cool. cool. So cool. Once you realised it wasn't scary, it was so cool. Yeah, it's basically it's Monsters Inc. Mansion. That's what it is. <laughs> monsters Inc. Mansion. Yeah. Minus the uh, IP. Well, no, no including the IP. Minus the legality. Yeah. <laughs> and that's the end of the day, guys. It's hit five o'clock and the park is closed. How fun was that today? So fun. It was great so fun, wasn't fun. it? Ali's really enjoyed it. Uh, we've enjoyed it as well. <laughs> and the weather held out. It's not it even did. raining anymore, which is amazing. This is the first in a little mini series here of what we're doing with all the Gulliver's Park in the UK. If it's been a couple of weeks and we've done the other video, it's going to be there in the top corner. If not, it's just a recommendation from YouTube. Thanks for that. Down at the bottom, that's for you new guys. Check us out. That's our channel. Give it a quick look. If you like what you see, hit the subscribe button. Until next time, guys. Bye. See you on the next adventure. Catch you later. <laughs>